Whatever you say, bro. All right, whatever you say, bro. Welcome back to episode number three. It is time for War Tables Cooperative with Chris. Chris uh, and then I decided we want to go and find ourselves some pirates. So that's going to be our next big thing. Are you fencing yourself fighting the uh, mm, uh, the uh, the ghost pack? It is leather, right? Uh, there like is some leather. leather and some ghost leather. So, well. Too late, let's start the session with a bang. So you remember how the ghost pack works, right? Uh, fight them, after a round or two the big guy appears, we beat the big guy, we win. Right. But you can only take three hits, um, you build up terror, and whenever your terror is uh, too high, you are essentially fleeing the battlefield and you reduce terror by killing uh, enemies, so land the killing blow. Interesting. All right. Do you mind if I go in with Freya and uh, go ahead? Out? Knock yourself out. Fantastic. If we kill well, all, not to get knocked out. Uh, mm -hmm. If we kill all three of them in this round, uh, we're essentially going to um, prevent the big bad evil guy from spawning. I doubt we will be able to do that. Um... Nice little hit. We definitely need to get you a better weapon. Indeed. There you go, you got the first terror st uh, stack. Yep, but now she can't get attacked and uh, we can get another... Do you mind if I take a turn with uh, my archer? Uh, see what we could do... Uh, well, no, not at all. You can actually go there and use your zone. I think that's exactly. fantastic. I'll set up my zone and then you can knock enemies away. For, uh, Try to hit all three of them. Away. Yep, I do. I do. There you go. Fabulous. All right, so a couple of uh, things to begin with. Um, for starters, I do have uh, smoke screen. That should have triggered uh, the zone as well. A bit no, because they didn't move. You definitely want to uh, go in now and uh, make that boar move, so I get the attack on that. Also, yeah, we'll see if uh, you get hit now by the uh, zone. Uh, I'll just position myself over yeah, here. I like that. I think that's the better that's uh, idea. Poor Freya is gonna get another terror now. What the? All right. Weird. Um, and now we're going to reposition this into that. Yep. Then uh, once the turn ends, you can just repeat the same bullshit. There you go, protection on everybody. Use the Veiler, because now the Nightmare stack appears. And we gotta fight them. Go ahead and uh, knock the boar back again. Uh, happy to comply. There we go. Um, yeah. The <laughs> I do have an idea, and that idea includes tanking uh, the wolf that gives uh, that is uh, neutral when it comes to valor points that's unfortunate so we have two terror on uh, freya so i definitely want to kill that uh, you definitely wolf. want to kill the ghost wolf yeah. yeah without a shadow of a doubt Keep it going, keep it moving. There you go, see? Terror gone. Entirely gone, actually. Yep, you um, lose two terror, I think, or three per kill. So, do we rush down the big gun? Yeah, yeah, do we, we need to go those? get uh, get them. He's going to use a spell called Binding Terror, which yeah, will deal well, damage. To to another person, right? So yeah, now we have the little problem where I cannot actually damage the big guy, so 
Oh, you can. Uh, uh, don't worry. Uh, go a little bit uh, cl uh, closer. No, I can only damage them if they move. Remember? Yeah, yeah. I uh, figured I could push it, but yeah, it's fine. You, you do I'll, whatever. Uh, I'll, I'll place myself next to you, and then you can knock back the wolf. Okay, very good. Sounds like a plan. Sure does. Um, Time to find out if I can shoot you. <laughs> we're starting to hit. I'm starting to move over here. Little sickle for good measure. And we're going to go in and get the stack in a second. Uh, but for now... Well, let's just stay here. We're good. Uh, what the? So that's Binding of Terror. Uh, it moved. It yeah. never moved in the past. Oh, yeah, it, uh, that is new for me as well. Anyways, Binding of Terror. <laughs> the unit takes three terror at the end of the turn, but it is removed uh, when they are next to an ally affected by that effect. So essentially, yeah. we want to kind of um, easy peasy. Uh, um, so I will start and uh, give you the kill, and then you can do whatever you uh, oh want. <clears throat> okay, Look at that. And uh, not only are we going to do that. Uh, no, that's exac exactly what we're going to do. That's all we're going to do. Um, I guess I'll move my uh, ranger in. I'll uh, set up my zone, and then uh, I'll get you an energy. You can yep. dash behind the big Just make sure that and, you uh, stay next to Kalia, so that uh, you don't produce uh, three terror. Oh yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll stay here. That. See, the debuff is gone now. Yeah, okay, fantastic. So now I'm going to engage it, and yep. then you can go behind and attack it. Bomb, bomb, bomb! There you go. You got three terror. Wait, what? Every single hit gives you one terror. But I think uh, you can go up to no. five terrors. Um, so I think you're still okay. Well, I hope so, because uh, else we're a bit screwed. No, we're still good. We good? Yeah, I mean, it's your turn. All right, uh, sorry. In which case, uh, first of all, disengage. Why? Because then it's a take of opportunity time. Uh, well, you just made Freya run away, so... I know. No, not the smartest idea there. No, he would have run away anyways, because uh, the nightmare attacks. Um... Oh, should have told me before I attacked it. I forgot that it uh, get, gets you one per attack, which is a bit much. So we're just going to move to here, mainly because I uh, want you to take that extra shot. Yeah, that's uh, great thinking. Not so great thinking on the... Well, <laughs> fuck you, creature. <laughs> we're good. Yeah, yeah, take that. There you go. Oh, nice. Okay, closer than expected. I uh, don't need a repair at the moment, but we need heal. For your info, what you could also do is uh, to save tools. You can right click your character that needs repair, in this case Freya, and then yeah. manually click on repair. Uh, because it only uses, uh, it always uses kind of uh, tools until you are absolutely full. It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the easy way of getting through that? We got nine leather and quite a bit so of leather that we don't need. But... No, but quite a bit of uh, extra items. Look at that. We burning have a burning stake camp up here. What could that possibly be? a uh, resource uh, drain for lumber good uh, guess what 
Uh, I have a person who could get us lumber. If there is a lumber, I log. have only a single. I only have a single point on alchemist, so I can switch to. On Alden. Uh Look at that. By the way, there is stealable wood. Uh, who was the? Um, was we don't have a thief, but I could make Aldenor a thief. Uh, aren't you losing experience? Uh, a single point. Good, then make Aldenor a thief real quick and steal the wood, please. Because uh, we need plenty. That? that is on the log. Oh, okay. Steal. Yes, please. And then we just drag that over. Yeah. Uh, nothing happened. Weird. Right, right uh, click on steal, then you need to select the thief. Yeah. Okay. And then I need to right click. Oh, there we go. All right. Okay. We're at uh, 60 we suspicion. Let's not overdo it. But what we're going to do what? is we're talking to the Inquisition. Ah, the and this guy wants. He's out for blood. Down by the light's reckoning. We require no further proof of her. I, I am not a heretic. Oh, please, you must believe me. How are we to burn this heretic at the stake? All our wood was ruined by the rain. If we try to set it on fire now, the prisoner will agonize for hours. We cannot yeah, you hours possibly donate minutes, a few great. logs in exchange for our blessing. All right, so what's the plan? <laughs> I have no idea what these guys do. Uh, this I just let him... Huh? This is the Inquisition, so they typically burn heretics. They become more important in Drombach because that's where they kind of uh, suppress everybody. So, what's the RP? Uh, do we want to uh, oh, use? I don't like him. Okay, well then, hit their stupid face. Let's go. Indeed. You don't need to convince me to go into a battle. Well, that certainly looks like very competent enemies, Jesus Christ. Oh yeah, oh yeah. We have no energy, so I can't do any zoning. Um, there is a rusty hatchet um, right behind us. The uh, main is... guy cannot reach us this turn, where we are. The two-handed sword guy can reach us. The guys, the other two guys can't either. So the only guy that can reach us is the fanatic that goes first. Yeah. So, How about uh, you uh, go behind my tank and put up a zone? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then we still have the rusty hatchet, which is an extra damage if needed. Yep. Phenomenal. Does the rusty hatchet do destabilization? I think that's better for the Inquisitor. That is perfect me. for the Inquisitor if uh, the Inquisitor ever comes up. So, can I move? Yeah, I can move all the way behind and attack from there. Or that do you want good. to initiate first? Uh, I could, with initiation, I can give us um, a Vela point. Yeah, do that, please. And then I'll go next with the uh, X Men. X Woman. Oh, it moves them away. Okay, well, that sucks. Um, uh, you might want to not be right in front of them, else I can't attack. But you can't go closer either, because then you will be in range of the Inquisitor. You'd have to be at the top side of the enemy to avoid him attacking you. Yeah, what I can do is I could yeah, go up. Over there you. is fine. Yep. Just barely out of range. <laughs> Uh, we can take out the Zealot, I think, in a Yeah, that time. is a good idea. Let me just double check where I'm allowed to stand. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. We'll go to, oops, we'll go to here. I don't think you need energy. No, no, you go ahead. It moved a little bit too close. I want to be there. And then let's see. Knock yourself out, buddy. For the bonus damage. No, we cannot. What a shame. There you go. You can pretty I can yourself, yeah. Quite literally 
Ah, not quite enough. So close. Uh, but I will be moving over here for the next round so that there is a chance to hit the Inquisitor with it. Just need to get Aldor out of the way and then I can throw the hatchet. Um, but maybe we want to kill the Zealot first. Yeah, I mean, you know, I, I could can... get us an a Vela point. Wait, 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 let me go first. I can get us a okay. Vela point and uh, look at that. Bam! Destabilization. How cool is that, please? Mm -hmm. Moving into. Bam! A Vela point. Moving yeah. into coward, cowardly hiding behind you. Two All right. points would have been useful, but we don't have any way of gaining them. Or can Kualu get us a point? Um, Kualu indeed can get us a point by engaging with someone. So uh, he can simply stand in the middle here and get engaged upon if you want that. I think it's not a bad idea. Yeah, but in that case, I might as well take Freya's turn. I, um, yeah. I can get them together. Uh, so if I position myself in the. No, no, do whatever yeah. you want. Yeah. I'll start. I'll engage the Inquisitor. All right, Inquisitor. Zero guard, which means... Well, actually, I'm not going to engage shit because... Oh, no, I did engage. Okay, cool. You can uh, triple attack, I think, uh, using... No, I want to set up my zone okay. with uh, Aldenor on his turn. Because uh, we should get at least two attacks out of that. Three if you actively disengage. There you go. There you have your... Uh, your zone. All right, so that guy goes next. Bit of a shame that he's in combat, uh, gonna be in combat with you. Oops, uh, cancel. I can um, disengage if you want. You go to here. Okay. And then. That's a good zone. That's zone. a fantastic zone. Indeed. That's a point for you, too. So. Oh, nice. Oh, what? Why did he die? Uh, he stepped on a trap. Wow. <laughs> All right, so now you can uh, potentially knock... Uh, you could either disengage and knock away the Inquisitor. Okay. Happens okay. automatically. I don't have an option. But what I can do, um, and what I should do, is move to here and reduce the, uh, the Inquisitor's damage by 50%. Uh, was neutral because I get one Valor for re-engaging. There you go. All right, good shit. Uh, if you want, I can disengage again. Yeah, go ahead. Do that. <laughs> there we go, got our three attacks. And he's vulnerable. However, he's vulnerable because of... Um, uh, because... I don't know, actually. Yeah, I, I shouldn't... I don't have anything that gets vulnerable, so... Um, Weird. Let me stand all the way up here, and that will give you the best uh, setup for another zone. Uh, I don't have the points for another zone. Well, you have a normal uh, zone. Yeah. True. And you can stand right next to someone and still have a great zone. Yeah. I go over here. It's a funny. Uh, it's a funny mechanic. Using zones so much. And it's a lot of damage. And we're getting another Vela point. Alright, cool. And now because our good friend with the axe is not engaged. Ah, oh, shit. I can't get it too ta targeted, I think. Uh, right. I can... Okay. I'll, uh, I'll get behind our axe wielding friend and we'll try to take him out in one swoop. Okay, go ahead. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Well played. And... Uh, There you go. Um, I don't have any movement left, so that's... We're going to re-engage. Ouch. Oof. Now that's when uh, what's happening when he's not weakened, right? But, good news. Whatever he can do, we can do as well. And whilst <laughs> we're at it, look at that. 
There goes another attack of opportunity. All right, I mean, they go last, so I'll set up uh, a zone again. Go ahead, yeah. Behind our, our good friend here. And then uh, you can take a turn and knock him away. Okay, sure. How about this? Into that for weakening. Into that for knock away. Into that. <laughs> Aldenor has unlocked the trade glorious. Fantastic. Oh, look at that. Paladin Segmenta. So much for me crafting heavy armor. Fuck me. Uh, I haven't uh, checked it yet. Let me just heal real quick because we've. Oh, what a boss arm. Okay, I'll take that right. one. <laughs> and I repaired my armor like a stupid idiot. Okay, never mind. I have 38 guard. 38 guard now. And uh, the theoretically, three armor slots. Holy. Thank you. I am so grateful. Look at that. We get a uh, sapphire and poisonous oil, which Would is good because. As one of your companions. She's a ranger, and we don't need a ranger. Unfortunately, level three, too. Okay, how do you feel about uh, getting her? Was that the right uh, choice? Uh, saving I her, I mean. point in taking her, yeah. I mean, look, I don't like religious fanatics, so uh, yeah, fuck him. Fuck him, okay, <laughs> cool. Um, do we have a... We don't have a box to uh, launder wares yet, right? No, we d uh, don't have that yet. Shame. Look at that, there's more uh, knowledge. Um, just a idea. Um, you might want to rest before we fight dwarves. Yeah, I'm just double checking. We're learning the remaining apprentice weapons. And you're right. We're going to take a good rest. Pay our guys. And just take a rest. Wait a second, wait, wait, wait. Hollow, you want to take him to the, the bonfire? Um, sure on yeah, we don't have a monolith. Yeah, you're right. Okay, cool. Don't have a scholar. Good, and I get us the extra oh, heavy trade. We do have... Shit, we did have a... We have a camp chest. I could have tried to launder the wood. Oh, well. Oh, okay. Well, we can do that now. It is in the camp chest, so you might as uh, you might as well do that. All right. Okay, fantastic. Um, well, not bad. I think it's time for the wolves. Indeed. Indeed. One second. Mm -hmm. Let's go back in action. I uh, needed to take a very small break there. Chris, are you ready uh, to battle the wolves? Yeah, All right. seems, seems pretty easy. We're going to see about that. There's at least an alpha wolf. I was thinking, are you interested in taking on the legendary bosses as well? Sounds like a way to get the uh, run ended. <laughs> uh, feel free to position yourself wherever you want. Yeah, from what I remember about them, they were like pretty ridiculous to try and fight. Uh, we do have a good team. Not so sure about that. Uh, yeah, I'm not too happy with uh, anything here, really. Mm. And that means that wolf goes for it. There we go, that's better. Yeah, this is fine. Okay. I'll just uh, hide like a little bitch behind the tank and set up uh, the basic zone. Oh, I can actually set up a big zone. Yeah, go ahead. We'll do that. Thank you. 
Look at that, you hit the alpha right away. Um, if you want, I push it uh, back for you. Run. Hit. Into shot. Into uh, effectively baiting them by standing here. That's how quickly you can get three hits in. Yeah, that's 42 damage. It's pretty nice. Shell, you know, go ahead. Oh, yeah, you go ahead. Get yourself your energy. There is that extra point. And there is uh, the attack of opportunity into waiting here. That gives us another uh, Valor. And it's perfectly set up for you. Mm -hmm. All you need to do is not screw it up. Oh boy. How's a crit for not fucking it up? <laughs> <laughs> Two crits. <laughs> Three crits. Freya is pretty uh, sick. Like the Berserker spec is actually quite good. Sure looks like it. Is there still a wolf left? Yeah, from be below, but you might want to get up so that the wolf can get all the way up here. Uh, well, the wolf literally can't get further far enough, so I'll just chill here. All right, a chiller. Uh, I think you can get it down in one go with Freya. That is uh, a possibility. Let's see. Yeah, definitely. Jesus Christ. You are dishing out some ridiculous single target damage. We got Indeed. some uh, we got some grease, which is good. That is what we needed. And we uh, got some more, true, yeah. uh, some more leather. Do you need grease too for some of the stuff you want to make? Uh yes, partially for torches. Mm. But I'm okay with giving it mainly to you. Uh, it's not a big deal. No, it's just for the... Um... Oh, finally, oh. there is a lockpick. And that means you, my friend, as our thief, can try your best uh, to lockpick. Indeed. Uh, we could, by the way, execute these sheep for food. All right, but first, I need a lockpick in our group inventory. Oh, I'm sorry. My bad. It's all good. There you go. You have your lockpick. Uh, somehow that doesn't work, so I need to actually put it in mine. Weird. Rotate all right. Oh, no. Show us how it's done. Uh, no. There you go. First try. Well done. We got more leather, that is super helpful, and a bit of uh, salesy loot. Do we want to slaughter the sheep? I mean, I'm pretty sure there's no point in leaving them alive. That's a weird take on just killing stuff, but sure. We're in the Middle Ages. It's an animal. It has no rights. Okay, here we go. Look at that. We got a couple of carcasses we got uh, mutton so that is good and we're we also got over encumbered well that can easily be changed look at that carcass is gone and we're fine indeed but you're right we need uh, to sell a lot of stuff and look at that just as we were speaking speaking uh, about it these valuable commodities are only for those who can afford them. Hmm. Good, let's sell a lot of the stuff. That. A uh, couple of carcasses. And that. Yeah, we're having a bit of a carrying uh, problem, but that is typical. Any point in grabbing the Cray Clusters this early? Uh, 
which is what? Where? The gray clusters. Uh, well, I mean, they are not bad uh, because that will be... I think that's a, a good idea. Let's just get them for your next uh, level in smithing. That will be level six, but we eventually will reach it and then we will have too little of them. Good. Didn't want to buy the wheat. Uh, we could. That's fine. They That's fine. Bandits. We have nothing. We're nah. We can't spare any food. We're short on food ourselves. Okay, we wanted to go uh, to the pirates. Go over, yeah, I'll go over the pirates. Oh, there's some wood over here. I'll grab that. We will need a lot of wood. That's what you said. Well, just one wood. Thanks, game. <laughs> <laughs> we need a lot of wood. wood. Can we even get through here without a pass? Uh, 200 gold pieces and we can get through it. It's pretty expensive just for some pirates, dude. Well, I haven't. I I did not make the rules. Oh wait, 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 wait. Not let's not give it. I do have an idea. Little trick, Arino. Um... Pretty sure if we manage to get up on the south end here, we can make a python cross. Exactly, and that was the idea. 200 gold is 200 gold. She's a lot more than two pints. True, and we haven't used the single we'll one. Yeah, yet. we'll probably want to rest before we go into the woods. Ah. It's going to be fine. It could potentially go wrong in the woods. Well, we'll get attacked in the night. Yeah. So unfortunately yeah, there is no way around it, but I know a way of getting there via the temple. So we need to go all the way around here. We should rest, we should rest. We should definitely rest. <laughs> Before we're in the woods. Well, I got that set up, that set up. Uh, you didn't pray on the shrine. You should have done that. Yeah, my bad. Uh, looks like we didn't get wrecked by it. Fantastic. But we got a trade for Kualu. Uh, medicine or bad stuff? I think we're just using medicine. Because Freya somehow was... Um, was having a illness or a disease. Uh, by the way, we can appoint captains uh, now. Uh, the captain is the one who can uh, create the uh, who can uh, create a lot of valor, but he needs to be uh, kind of in the middle of the action where everybody else is. Do you think that Kualu might be the right person for the job? Potentially, yeah. Good. I mean, we only have two people in the middle of the action. It's either got to be Kualu or uh, Freya. Yeah, Guess what? We'll Kualu, he has the best gear too. Look at that guy. Already looks like an absolute badass. I got us something else, which you will en uh, enjoy. Which is the strategy table. There you go. And if we, if we now have the option, attacks of opportunity uh, deal increased damage by 10%. Or support uh, is uh, damage reduction by 30% instead of 20, or flanking. Um, Considering damage. you have disengaged, we should probably take the attacks opportunity now. All right, there we go. Fantastic. See, already, already uh, made it worthwhile for us. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. As the moon goes. There's something in the woods over there. Yeah, so. those are bandits. We might not want to fight them. 
uh, we do have a job for the uh, rats here if you want if you fancy yourself doing rat infestation but we don't have I, a cure for the plague so we have a single cure actually i bought that earlier oh nice okay uh did we inspect that i think we did we did good we can now get all the way up to uh, up the hill and on top of the hill we can definitely python down i've done that in the past oh. that's a lot of enemies yep a lot of enemies means a lot of loot you got to see it from uh, the positive angle and we got uh, galvanizing true plus we got enough for you to set up like the most nasty of control zones yeah i think archer going first is gonna be pretty mandatory here <laughs> jesus uh yeah freya is actually exactly right where she is maybe i'll put her here yeah and then we'll set up a zone i guess with the archer first all right go ahead that seems like uh, the best choice here and just make approaching us a living hell. And that counts as an attack of opportunity, by the way. Yep, that is an attack of opportunity. That is one of the reasons why I argued for it. How about I give us this here? Nice. <laughs> and that. Into that. <laughs> Always in the eye. <laughs> why, Aldenor? Why? and reduce damage which we will be able to use because uh, there's some guys coming yeah go ahead i only have one attack opportunity left so you can go in and there's going to be plenty of opportunities they have a putrid list we should try and capture them and recruit them <laughs> we don't have uh chains at the moment and their putrid list has no traits so Maybe not the best choice. So much for always uh, taking the positive outlook, eh? <laughs> <laughs> he, he is shit. All right. All right. You're, it's <clears throat> your turn. Uh, I think I can get two targets here, so yep. I'm just going to do that. Um, nine and a half, so. Uh, let's see. Nice. And then you might want the yeah. archer. That's a good idea. Wrecked. Let's hope you are going mm -hmm. to survive that. I mean, I would hope so. Yeah, the pugilist is pretty good against melee. Jesus. <laughs> Don't you. Okay. Um, listen, it's not all uh, bad. We do have this here. That's two attacks of opportunity. Bam and bam. All right. We poison man. Ugh. Any flowers? Yeah. All the way in the back. And I'll take the pugilist off of you. That's very nice of you. Wow. You might want to set up a zone or something, yeah, and uh, exactly. definitely we need to deal with a hot loom because that guy won't be a problem. Can also hide behind the tank um, with uh, Freya. I'll do this, and then I'm gonna fuck off with uh, Freya. The question is, can I? Wait, get wait, wait! To if you let me go first, I can actually bind him. Is that okay? okay. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Look at that. All right. And I guess what I'll do is I'll move. If you can kill the guy, that would be fantastic. Yeah. I'll kill the Marauder. Do you want me to kill the, the Scoundrel? The, the Scoundrel, if possible. Because right. uh, then if we can get a crit. No such luck, but he's definitely gonna die now. Fantastic. Because then I we're and saving. Then I'm gonna heal. There you go. Good job. A 
Okay, uh, how about... You might want to attack this. First. Into that. Into that. Oh, yeah. Good. I can <clears throat> push it back and... Uh, no, me... you'll take damage if you do that, so... Okay, you don't care. Yeah. No, because the fight is over before the round is over. I see. Oh. Cool! Isn't that... Gear is a bit shit here? Yeah, the gear isn't that great, but we can did not come here for the gear, we came here for a way... for free passage. By the way, there is a legendary enemy right there. Yeah, about that. Shall we kill him? I, I don't think we can. But we could give it a try. Giving it a try means we die if we fail. No, because we can always flee. Uh, Just a couple of wounds if you flee. Is my thing gonna work? Um, my attack opportunity stuff against this guy? Yeah, sure. It's a ranger, by the way, so it's a good bow for you. Yeah. Main question is, yeah, sure. Look, we'll, we'll try. You, you want to do it? You seem to be full of yourself, so. <laughs> We're going to see how how it's going to plan out. I am no ghost. I am Kagal. As for you, how dare you track me down, dogs of Edith, to the general, Harag? All right. I was going to be very very painful i think he was uh the one that had uh the bow that gave him no he has uh piercing arrows so we don't want to stand in a row and he has beast taming all allied uh, animals engaged in combat execute and attack of opportunity which means you don't want to be engaged and he calls in reinforcements if there are allies, uh, if there are no, um, if there are no animals in combat. Yeah, I mean, dude, I see six enemies. Like, that's 180 hit points. That's another 150, and then he himself. That's really rough. Maybe we start down here with a spear. Like, once we engage with him, things are not too bad. Although, wait, 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 if uh, we could go up here and we just uh, zerk him down, that might be the plan. Can we do that? I have no idea. I guess we'll find out. Uh, this looks really bad. Well, you can set up a zone uh, towards uh, the boars. Uh huh. And I'll, uh, I'll. No, I can't because we don't have any energy. Okay, well, you can set up the normal zone. Well, then, how about we're taking that lower section here like we originally said? Bum rushing him without energy wouldn't work. So, like <clears throat> shall we go for the uh, for the wolves first? Uh, yeah, probably. It should be easier to take out. And maybe Put I'll up stay up here. here for now. Okay. We're still good. There you go. It got an attack of opportunity off. Um, all right. Um, Shall I put myself in front? So yeah, you guys. Do you want to go for the wolves? Uh, aggro them, and then I try to take out one of them with uh, Freya. I think that's a fantastic idea. Especially if the second one comes in, there's a decent chance I'll have a, a two shot. Uh, you do have the spear with uh, Freya, so you could also go for the uh, for the boar. 
but I think the wolves are dealing more damage. So let me uh, go in. I'll position myself in a way that um, that they would come in as a pack. Now they will all run towards me. Uh, unfortunately, we cannot uh, yet gain. Um, we cannot yet uh, gain Valor. And yeah, we, we can't afford staying in a line. I need to engage uh, him with a the tank. There you go. Now you do have the option to set up a full a zone or... Yeah, kill. sadly, not really. I could engage him. I think that's not a... Mm. Or I can just take out the boar for now. Yeah, let's do that. Oh shit. Ooh! Okay, well, how about retreating? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Was already clicking on the shoot thingy before. Uh, it's bad. Uh, I don't have any potions. I can't heal the wounds. Uh, me neither, but... We can... We'll have to do that in the town when we yeah, get there. Yeah, repair. A ghost? Huh? I am no ghost for you. Death to the no, 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 we're leaving. Harag will live. Good. He uh, beat us for now, but we're going to F him over. I gave you some tools so you can uh, kind of... Uh, we should repair so we can rest. Good. We can rest down here, Chris. <laughs> I must admit it was maybe a little bit too cocky to uh, go for him. I mean, none of the numbers seem to work out. Uh, we should probably assign someone to the altar. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, we yeah. just had too little uh, damage for what we're trying to do. We just had too little damage for what we were trying to do. Got a bit cocky with those uh, lucky hits from Freya. It's like, yeah, we can take him. Nah, we can't, nah. bro. We definitely can. Ugh. There you go. What? Oh, it moves the spell down. Um, I think I need to build a couple more pythons. Uh, let's build three. Good. As you can see, we have not only reached the temple, but also that would be our opportunity here to capture uh, some of these guys and uh, get a reward. Unfortunately, we have no chains. No, but we're <coughs> going to get some soon. All right. Um, just set up a zone immediately. Uh, My, uh, sure, why not? Yeah, I think that's a great idea. Pugilist will come in. No longer, no longer allowed to uh, crit anybody, which is a bit of a shame. Pugilist will definitely come in. Phew. Takes a hit. Deals damage. I can push him back. If you want to. You sure can. There you go. That's a solid hit. And look at that. They're best friends now. Good. And look. Protection just for the sake of it. Uh oh. There is the fire damage. AoE attacks. All right. Um, I think you want to go and get your point, right? On the saboteur? Uh, could try that. Uh, 
No matter how I um, slice and dice it, I need it to move around because elsewise I would have burned. A bit unfortunate. Our party works out very well, but we can definitely use that extra Spearman and uh, Pugilist. Go for the Henchman? Let me see what that... Uh... Well, you could mm. kill the Henchman in one go. It's true, but then I will get a turn. Yeah, sure. Also, it's not sure. If I crit, then yes, but if I don't, then he'll survive. He is dead already, but... Just ever so slightly. Go to here. Good. What do you want to do? Uh, <clears throat> the henchman will kill himself. Yep. Move out of the way with the archer, grab the heal. Yeah, that's a Get good idea. Burning and then uh, set up a zone. You can even set up a uh, two point zone, but there's not really a point. So, to a one point. Well, zero point. More fire. I knew it. <clears throat> Now the guy dies. Uh, I guess I can just go ahead and start wearing down the henchman. Uh, I could help you. Uh, There you go. Lots of damage and he's burning. Which means he's effectively dead, but unfortunately you're burning now as well. Hit. Yeah, that's really annoying that you can't like engage him without spending a point. Yeah, the attack has advantages, but also very clear disadvantages. And now everybody's burning. Indeed. Um, I think uh, Freya is fine. Do you want me to take out yeah, the Yeah, that is her? a great idea. Let's do that. <laughs> no crits at all. Really annoying. Well, wait for it until you crit a little bit more. Yeah. Because she gets 50% more damage if she crits on that thing, so... Uh, I could take the other guy off of you. Yep. No, you cannot. Move Alenor away. Not sure, does that provoke an attack of opportunity? No, no, because we were not engaged, but he will die now. One way or the other, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. GG, good fight. I like it. Uh, there is a hammer, which does absolutely nothing for you. Yep. We do have to carry weight to keep it, though. Yeah, I couldn't uh, select. Uh, we could uh, kill the wolves for leather and... Actually like that idea. Just uh, maybe a repair first. You can do that now. Yeah. Right click your character. Uh... And there is still one more tool. Oh, now it's in front, yeah. Yeah, I would like Freya to have some more armor. Okay. Good, we definitely don't have enough tools, so we, after this one, we need to uh, hit 
a town. Okay, very easily defendable uh, position there. Unless you leave Freya where they uh, where yeah, she yeah. is at. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not. Uh, main problem is no points. Well, so, that is not uh, a problem in a second. Man. Let no, no, no. Let me oh. uh, go first. All right, go ahead. And you might want to position your archer north. Okay. Because that gives you all the points that you need. Pretty neat. Yeah, you kind of don't want to engage now. <laughs> but you can do your back knock slam, I guess, if you can still make it back a little. Not sure if I can, and it wouldn't be knocked back, but what I can is 30% less damage, but still gives you enough to engage and we're good. That is even one more Valor. Yep. And now you can All do right. whatever you want. So, who do we have here? This wolf, that wolf. A lot of movement in the south. Um, yeah, you might want to stand even behind Kalia yeah, and take shots from there. You just need to be adjacent to a person. Although, if you... Yeah, that's even better. Yeah, I want to be there. Because actually. then I get supported with Kualu. This is... Should be guaranteed that Yeah, they yeah, that's good, that's good. Yeah, let's see. Curious. Yes. If we get you a better bow, well, then you're going to be such a menace. True. Alright. Uh, I guess I'll uh, do a bit of uh, AoE here. A little bit of AoE. Oh, almost so close. Indeed. And then if you pop your uh, attack for opportunity thing, that's two dead wolves. That indeed. Let's go. Mm, new trait for frame. She has a lot of traits already, damn. I like the setup, it is very different to what I've played before. <laughs> yeah, pretty sick. Alright, I'll set up a normal zone, you can knock the guy back. That's a free, free shot there. Yeah, the combo with the sword is actually not too bad. Alright. Uh, well, I guess it's already dead then. Yeah. Uh, you can loot uh, this time. I think I cannot, so feel free to loot everything and put it into the bag. E everything except the carcasses, which we really don't need. Uh, seems to be waiting for you. Okay, let's go. Uh, we don't want to go to that Bennett's lair at the moment. Um, what we really want to do is get back home. Look at that, we crossed the border and we didn't even need to pay anyone. How cool is that, please? And by the way, the Brotherhood is here. Shouldn't we, yeah, shouldn't we put a Python? Oh wait, this is like, like a python over here. There you go, we got it. Normally you do one on the left and the right of the post. Okay, so good news. If one of your companions doesn't carry their weight, we can be afraid to teach them new skills. We sell stuff. With that for a price. So we do have uh, theoretically we have way, room for. We have way too many snow irises too. I'll just sell a few of them. Okay, sure. 
Yeah. What did you want to say? No, I was about to uh, think uh, whether or not we want to get one book, uh, and if so, which one we would want to get. Having another person of third aid, the first aid might be useful. Yeah, run would also be good on your character. Which one, though? On the see, we're sacrificing uh, poisonous oil, which now gives uh, knocks us just above the hurdle. For what? For uh, buying two books. So how about first aid and run? The books cost three sixty. We are at oh, 720. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Math hard. How the fuck? How the fuck am I out mathing you? <laughs> Good. We're almost uh, there. Yeah, let's but... just do. Let's just do one. Like uh, we don't need to go uh, close to you know death. Uh, but we are almost there. So close. Yeah. What's What's the point? Don't worry about it. Good. In which case, what's more important? I actually think first aid might be more important, right? Yeah. One of your guys, maybe. <clears throat> All right. Okay, well, in that case, uh, case, let's leave. And Kalia gets first aid, simply because she will get uh, from A to B very fast. Indeed. Good, and over here, um, are you done with laundering those locks by now? Yep. They are gone, so back to the campfire we go. Good, pay every everyone, and we should be good. Yeah, we need medicine and we need repairs, so it's potentially not too bad to... Uh, to not go all in. Uh, I could build a tent if you want me to. That gives more uh, happiness, right? Yeah, more valor. Uh, and uh, maximum valor points are also increased by one. Yes, uh, valor is good. We use a lot of valor, <laughs> especially you. Uh, we do seem to have a point unlocked in paths as well. Uh, that's well, true. multiple points actually. Well, I'll just uh, quickly collect those while you do your thing. At the moment, um, apprent we have a level in mysteries and wisdom. Oh, in the path. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I'm just collecting all our stuff for now. I think uh, the run duration would be not too bad. We actually, have two levels. <laughs> yeah, because we have crafted quite a bit and explored quite a bit. Well, okay. The aggression range. Approaching the rat's nest. I would say we're taking the run speed. And I agree, that's one point. Oh, we got a second one, yeah? Yeah, exactly. Well, the just a scratch isn't bad either. We take the or asceticism isn't bad either. Uh, either. Asceticism? Where did you see that? That's a little oh, bit here. further down. Requires reg learning frugality in the companion. So okay, wait a thing. second. I can do that. There you go. Less Damn. wages. Yeah, that's gonna be pretty crazy. Because at the beginning we really need to get kind of the, uh, a handle on the food and so on. Yep. Which means now we have enough uh, supplies to get another horse. <laughs> uh, theoretically, yes, uh, that is true. But we do have enough carry capacity, so I'm not too concerned. I'm not sure, man. We've, we've dropped some stuff before. It makes me very sad. Let's do. Let's end the episode here, and we're uh, going to do some housekeeping, uh, and we're back soon.